what's going on guys welcome back to the channel yes 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 it's been a week it's been a week it's been a while it's been a while but i've been missing doing my reactions man and it's it really is getting to me at this point because i really want to do reactions but i think <clears throat> um for the upcoming week christmas is up next week so definitely definitely things are slowing down i can see it i can see it anyways let's talk about spartacus spartacus this is episode six we're on now and it's looking very good man last one was very very exciting watching spartacus and Crixus crixus go up against i think it's theocles or whatever his name is um but it seems like um it seems like Spartacus took the the quote unquote victory when in all essence of the matter is um if it wasn't for Crixus blinding Theocles or whatever his name is. I don't remember. I think it's Theocles. I, I remember. <laughs> I'ma tell you the truth. I do not remember <laughs> this guy's name. But um Spartacus took him down but Crixus um blinded him with the shield um reflection of the sun or whatever um and blinding him and Spartacus took him down now how is this going to play out now for the rest of the season are they going to become friends I don't think so <laughs> I don't think Rick says and Spartacus is going to become friends because I think in some essence, I think he's going to get more of the quote unquote glory. You know what I'm saying? Spartacus is going to get a lot of that glory um, because the match ended with Crixus on his ass. So I'm thinking that people are going to be praising Spartacus over Crixus at this point. Um, so we'll see what happens. So let's jump into this, man. Let's not waste any more time. As I said, I apologize for the long wait between these episodes, man. Um, the season will soon be over. Just about a couple, a couple more weeks to go. Um, so we'll see. We'll see. We might get back to some, some normalcy around here because I'm really missing doing my reactions, to be honest, man. I'm really, I'm really am missing it you know like sometimes i'll be I, i'll be doing stuff and i'm like damn i wish i could get home earlier so i can at least knock out a, uh, an episode and i still end up coming home late so um because that's really the biggest issue that i'm having you know that's really the biggest issue is just me i'm coming home super late so, <laughs> so it's like regardless you know this is crazy but anyways man let's jump into the episode see you guys for the review all right so let's talk about this a little bit spartacus episode six bruh Out of everything I expected for, for, for that episode as how it was going, I never expected Sura to die. I thought it was going to be like a tough situation going forward for them, you know, being in the villa trying to, you know, copulate, whatever the situation is. And that's how the story was going to continue. And that's what was in my head. I never thought... That all this time I was rooting for Batiatus that he would arrange something like this. I know the dude is brutal. Like, don't get me wrong. But he's always retaliated against people who has been disloyal to him. There was no reason for him to kill Sura. It was always him on the defense. That's why I was rooting for him. You know what I'm saying? Like, I never expected him to be like this. Like, to be... And I guess now he's got a taste of what he could do and what he could be doing just to stay in good standing. So um, he's completely gone away from that. Like it was it, it was kind of weird. It was kind of weird for me seeing that 
he's behind it. He he might as well have said it to his wife. You know what I'm saying? He might as well have said it um, to her. You know what I'm saying? So I I totally I'm not gonna be rooting for this dude anymore. Like I don't like him now. I don't like him now because he broke um, a sense of trust between him and Spartacus now. So how can I, I, I can't trust him with anything now. You know what I'm saying? Um, that dude, um, there's always place in the bed. I keep forgetting his name. Um, he's the little finger off the show, man. You know what I'm saying? Telling you one thing, then making deals behind the back. And I'm also wondering if he has something to do with the the um with Sura's death or the 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 cart getting um the the cart you know getting um attacked. I'm wondering if he had something to do with that too. I wouldn't be surprised if he is you know, if he's involved somehow. So of that going on, Barker died for nothing because he actually did kill the kid. And that's why I was, that's why I was like, I was a little confused because they didn't show they They did not show that on purpose when he when at the end they didn't show it. They, they did it on purpose not to show it. But I was in my head. I'm thinking that he did kill the kid, because if you guys remembered when we watched that episode, how I responded to it, I was saying, don't kill the kid, don't kill the kid, like, you get what I'm saying, so, I was relieved when he, when he told his, his lover boy, you know, I, I was relieved when he told him that, you know, he didn't kill the kid, I was kind of relieved, then he said he was lying, so I was confused, because I was like, did you do it or not, <laughs> you know, but, also, they set it up where the, um, the, I can't remember his name, but um, that high-ranking official guy that's, you know, with the gangs or whatever, kid on to, to um, Batiatas and was saying, they you know, that was saying that they found the kid. So I was like, oh, so he was telling the truth. And then it turns out it was the messenger that was lying. And then it turns out that dude paid the guy to send the messenger to say that and <laughs> because of the information that he got from overhearing the two of them um barker and his lover boy talking in the shut in in the in, in the um you know in the place when he got that information but it it's a, it was a great episode they structured it in a way where it kept you confused um to what was going on so that was great because that's why mo the moments when everything was revealed, I was like, ah, oh. you know what I'm saying? They got me every time because it was it was a well-written episode, to say the least, to keep. They, they purposely did not do certain things so that when the, the moments are revealed, you know, it's a jaw-dropping moment. So it's excellent writing, man. Excellent writing. No doubt about it. Crixus is still in critical condition. I think he's going to come back. Um, probably not going to be the same you know, mighty man that he was before, but, um, I think he's, how will Dr. respond to this? You know what I'm saying? Is he, is he going to butt head with Spartacus or is, oh, you get what I'm saying? Is he going to butt head? Did he see what Spartacus was about to do? What is the situation? You know what I mean? So, um, I don't know, maybe he's going to have some sort of you know, understanding why Spartacus did what he did, you know what I'm saying? Um, because he probably would have done the same knowing that, you know, you know what I mean? Like for his wife, maybe he'll understand who knows. But anyways, man, this was great. It was a great episode. I like that. Looking forward to watching more. As I said, if I have time, at, at least I think this week to next week, um, this weekend going into next week is going to be totally different. So you might be seeing your boy, doing some double uploads and stuff like that next week um and that's a promise that is a promise I, I first time in a long time i promised you guys something that is a promise because next week you know it's definitely going to be slow because next week is christmas and then you know what i'm saying like it's just going to be slow so i know that for sure that it's going to be slow slow so i'll definitely be coming um on early because there's not much to do now 
you know what I'm saying? Last minute Christmas shopping, all of that stuff. So definitely next week, taking a break from everything except YouTube. <laughs> but anyway, thank you guys so much. Hope you guys are having a fantastic holiday season, man. And I will catch you guys for the next one. As always, there by react. Remember to like, comment, subscribe if you're new. Catch you guys later.